Video games have come a long way in terms of story, character designs. Now the stories are on par or sometimes even better than the movies that we watch nowadays. And when it comes to character designs, like technology has come so far that some of these characters look photo real and got them amazing to look at. Now in this video and this list, I'm talking about some of the top 10 hardest female video game characters of all time. Of course, there'll be a part two to this list. Before we get into it, I hope you guys subscribe, turn on that post notification bell not to miss that video and a lot more to come also now let's get right into it at number 10 we have Ada Wong Ada Wong has been part of the Resident Evil franchise since its beginning and has since been a core part and became playable since the second installment. Now, there's a reason why Leon Kennedy always chases after her throughout their relationship even though she screws him over 50% of the time. I mean, come on, look at her. She's a baddie. Who wouldn't fall for a woman who takes care of herself, capable of putting people six feet deep, who's also into red and black outfits and always looks stellar in them, whilst besides the obvious fact that she's goddamn pretty. She's definitely one of the hardest female game characters in this whole Resident Evil franchise and I for one am excited to see her again in the remake of Resident Evil 4. At number 9, we have Cortana from Halo. For anyone who has played the Halo games since the first one, Cortana has always been there, your AI companion who you go through thick and thin with. She's always been noticeable and stunning, but the newer design of Cortana starting from Halo 4, let's just say the developers made a plan to turn her from a 6 to a 12. Even though she's still holographic, resembling that of a naked female, and large bust, hourglass shape, and large behind, in addition to a beautiful facial features, makes you think that the developers must have designed a character first before anything else in the game. And of course, we got the recent Halo TV show, and <laughs> they went completely different directions. <laughs> Cortana looked so much different. I mean, it is a TV show, we understand that, but come on. <laughs> but it's cool though. Some people like Cortana in the TV show, others too, especially those who were faithful to the games, but hey, what can we do about that? At number 8, we have Naomi Hunter from Metal Gear Solid 4, Guns of the Patriot. A brilliant geneticist and a medical professional who first appeared as one of Snake's many codec supports in Metal Gear Solid, Naomi Hunter has advised Snake on a number of subjects over the course of his journey and missions even though she hated him first because he had killed someone she cared about. She's beautiful, has a charming accent and also a genius. No, she doesn't wear any skimpy clothes, any tight suits, but the qualities of hers that I mentioned before put her on this list. At number 7, we have Panem from Cyberpunk 2077. Even though Cyberpunk 2077 had a horrible launch that has been etched into the gaming history forever, the best part of it has been its characters. And even though it's been mostly fixed today, guess what? The characters are still the best parts of it. Judy or Panem, these two sparkle debate on the internet and still do today. But for this list, this very first one, I'll be talking about Panem. This badass from the Nomads made a huge impression on gamers from the first first interaction, your first meeting, I mean come on, <laughs> even a blind person will see what the developers were doing. She's a person not afraid to tell you what she thinks, fears and capable of taking down her enemies as well. One of the bravest people in this game, her stunning memorable hairstyle, attractive sexy fashion sense and bountiful beautiful behind curvy body and on top of that being this gorgeous no wonder people were online looking at playthroughs and guides on how to romance her at the sea spot we have trish marigold from the witcher franchise particularly the witcher 3. trish may perhaps be the most beautiful redhead ever when it comes to female video game characters she's been part of the witcher franchise from the beginning and the latest witcher 3 redesigns has made her even more attractive than ever she's charming confident and her freckled face makes her beauty stand out even more. Even though she's not as powerful as Yennefer, yes, she'll also be in a different list, don't worry. But in terms of sorcery, she's still strong in her own right and assists Geralt and Ciri and cares for them throughout the game. If you don't romance her in the game, then you can see like she's your hot sexy bestie. At number 5, we have Lady from Devil May Cry. Mary, who goes by the simple yet elegant name Lady, is a human devil hunter who becomes a playable character in Devil May Cry 4 Special Edition and meets Dante along the way whilst also going on her own personal mission 
and down the line becomes part of his crew just like trish another wonderful character who will also be in the next list now lady with her anime like adorable hair different colored eyes and extremely attractive body which is most heightened by her fashion sense makes her not only hard but amorous to add to that Coupled that with her intelligence and fun personality and also her combat skills and by that I mean her ability to wield big guns to destroy her enemies straight away whilst looking goddamn amazing doing it. At number 4, we have Tifa Lockhart from Final Fantasy VII, of course the remake. To me, she's one of the hearts of Final Fantasy VII. Tifa Lockhart is one of the protagonists and companion or close friend of Clouds and sometimes there's some romantic sparkles that, you know, that shines between them. In the game, she plays a pivotal role in helping Cloud fight against Sephiroth and is also there for emotional support and encouragement along the journey. She's an extremely powerful martial artist so you know and can dispatch her enemies with ease. She's remarkably stunning and gorgeous and known for her reddish brown eyes along with her long darkish hair. She's extremely athletic, curvous with nice apples to add to that and her revealing sexy outfit combined with all that and a lovely sometimes cute personality makes her stand out among all the ladies that we meet in the game and of course one of the hardest female game characters out there right now and the remake surely elevated that even more. At number 3, we have Bayonetta from the Bayonetta franchise. I think most people will agree with me that Bayonetta is the queen of Nintendo. There are some people maybe screaming in the comments right now saying it's Princess Peach from Mario or Princess Zelda. But wait, let, you notice one thing about these two mentions. Yeah, they are all princesses. Anyway, Bayonetta is an Umbra witch unique who is one of a kind due to her combined Umbra and Lumen heritage and is one of the strongest video game characters too. With remarkable or physical skills and abilities she received when she was a kid. She is highly skilled in bullet arts and also gifted in magic so if you wanna mess with her, please make a will before that. Now, Bayonetta is one of the most highly sexualized video game characters out there. We know that if you've played the games, you know. With their attractive, curvous features and slender frame and well endowed as well, the developers are sure to let you know that as well by putting her in revealing outfits, skin tight, might I add, and added to the fact that she also has some weird sexual moves when fighting or otherwise, which sometimes is a bit much. To add to that, her stunning grey eyes and the glasses she wears makes her stand out and a beauty to behold. The third game just got released I think this month and after all these years, man, she's still the queen like she never left. At number 2, we have Nico from Devil May Cry 5. Devil May Cry 5 raised the franchise to a whole new level with its amazing combat and stunning graphics and it was just excellent. Now some of the best parts about this game is the new character that was introduced, Nico, who got the world's attention even before the game's release with the trailers that she was shown in. Her full name Nicoletta Goldstein, Nico for short, is an expert craftswoman in the game and a friend of Nero and the mind behind his cybernetic prosthetic he wields. Her attractive slender figure and her somehow sexy revealing outfit with her tattoos make her the body that you will fall for. In addition to that, her cute glasses, freckled cute face and over the top yet wow hairstyle makes her not only just absolutely gorgeous but hot and sexy at the same time. <laughs> it's like a triple combo if I was to summarize that. And now at number 1. Numero Uno, we have Lara Croft from the Tomb Raider franchise. Now, when I started this video, you may have perhaps known that Lara Croft was going to be in there, and yeah, here she is. The incredible Lara Croft, one of the most famous and might I add iconic video game protagonists of all time. She is brave, near genius intellect, renowned for her broad knowledge of foreign languages, history and religion, making her one of the best if not the best archaeologist out there. And someone who can also send you to the hospital or six feet deep, that is if you mess with her as she's well versed in hand to hand combat and in mixed martial arts and the use of guns as well. In terms of looks well, <laughs> just look at her. Throughout the years, there's been a number of tweaks here and there. The character has gone through some revisions and uh, the newer trilogy, particularly the last two, she's been dialed up to be the best version of the character. Her signature brown hair, dark brown eyes, long legs makes sense since she's extremely athletic too. Her curvious figure, characterized by her wide hips and slender waistline, large bosom and well-shaped behind. It's no wonder she's been a poster on some of the walls of people, particularly 
particularly boys who grew up playing her games. Of course, with all her beautiful features, the developers also knew well and knew how to dress her by putting her in revealing outfits throughout her appearances in the Tomb Raider games. I mean, come on, who can forget her signature tiny shorts, hiking boots, and different types of tops, which shows her cleavage and mid torso. Though the newer games have changed that as a main outfit, even though it's still there in the numerous clothes that you can change into in the game. Lara Croft has always been one of the biggest sex symbols in gaming history and certainly one of the hardest and with there being rumors of a new game that may be coming, I would say it's not going to change anytime soon. Now that's it for the list, these are some of the most beautiful, gorgeous, hardest video game characters out there of all time. As you may have noticed, all of them are capable in their own right in terms of combat abilities. Yeah, they won't F you up. They are not just there for looking pretty. I know there are many other amazing characters out there as well and I'll be making a part 2 for this list. So I hope you subscribe, turn on that post notification bell not to miss that video and a lot more videos as well. Now that's it for the video, as always Nerdy Sage here. See you guys in the next one.